Hi friends, welcome back or welcome to my channel. If you're new, my name is Cynthia and I thank you for clicking on this video here today. So this is going to be a short collection video of my Sol de Janeiro um, mist that I have. And so I wanted to show you guys here. Um, I just finished a Victoria's Secret little video collection video that's why that's still up i'm kind of organizing as well but it's not an organizational video here i said it in the last video this is more of a collection let me show you those items that i have i'm going to put them back in it's just because going through a whole collection which i've done before it takes too much time and i don't have that right now i'm just trying to find room for my new mist that i got through victoria's secret but this video is about the sol de janeiro so let's get right into it and i see one down here i want to move them all up to like a top uh portion because they're like smaller little bottles so <laughs> this one here smells so so good okay the, the top was coming off so i was having a hard time there we have here the caramelized, oh my gosh, this Brazilian Crush Charosa 71 is so, so sweet and so good. And if you guys know me, you know I love those sweet scents. So there is this one. Let me push these back. I just seriously pushed all those back just so I could push put these right here in the front. So there's that one. I have two. I want these to go all right here. So this I'm going to move out of the way here in a second. And then this one, Real Radiance, the Sol de Janeiro Real Radiance. This one came out in the summer. It is a very summery scent, very good. It had coconut, right? I can hardly see creamy coconut. Yeah, uh, this one is a good one for the summer. And I try, what I hate is that they're like limited edition and I try to stop myself from using them up because I truly like them. I'm completely trying to, you know, get away from that mindset. Use it up, love it. Hopefully they bring it back. If not, if I really, really want it, let's see how much I would be willing to pay like on Mercari or places like that. Uh, probably not much. I hardly ever, I've never get stuff from there. Um, so we have this Brazilian Crush number 68. Is this the one that reminded us of the In the Stars? Remind me guys, I don't remember. I haven't used this one in a while. I used it a couple of times. You guys can see, but just a couple of times, not much. So there's that one. And then we have this Sol de Janeiro Anita. Anita. This one came out not the so this one here came out this last summer, I believe. And this one was two summers ago, basically, the previous summer. And another good basically uh summer one. But this one has like passion fruit, nectar, and pink patchouli. Yes. Okay. So there's that one. Then we have this Brazilian Crush 40, Charosa 40. That's that one. I do have small body butters for this one, this one, and this one. I don't remember if I still have that. I'm going to go look for my little body butters. Obviously, they're not here. So I can show you those as well. Um, this one, Do Not Disturb, it came out with the next one I'm going to show you that I completely fell in love with here. This one doesn't have a number, so it just says Do Not Disturb there, and then you guys can see the notes there. So here's that one. This is my favorite from the three that came out together. I'll bring the other one that came out with this set here. These are all these limited edition ones that they had. This is one of my favorites. I've told you guys in my last video, uh, the Chirosa 62 is my favorite. Pistachio is just my number one. But then um, this one was like my number two, and I've been trying not to finish it. But I'm going to go ahead and finish it, as I said, trying to get away from keeping it just because, you know, we don't have a backup. <laughs> and this one came out with these three right here. Um, bikini season yes bikini season here um, another good one summery one right there um, out of that you guys see my favorite was that one so what else do we have I went to get the little body creams that I have um, or body butters I don't know that's what they call it 
And but first I have two more. I was almost forgetting because this one I brought just put it in here. <laughs> it was by my bed, but I actually just put it in there because that one was right there. I'll show you which that one is. And here we have one of the newer ones. And I hope this is a permanent one. I when I look at it, it doesn't say limited edition, and I hope it's not because it is so so good. I love, love this one as well. So here we have where are the notes? It says uplifting notes of vanilla orchid, sugared violet, and sheer sandalwood. This is a must for me. I love this one as well. So I, between this one, this one, and this one, those are my top three right here. Number 62. That's not to say I don't like these other ones. Like number 71 is another really good. They're all good anyways. So here we have number 62, the OG right here. This is the first one that, you know, came, at least that I remember. I think they only had that one for the longest time, right, guys? Um, along with this uh, Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. So this is the one that paved the way to all of these other ones. But yeah, so I have the big one. I think I got this one in a set for Christmas along with this one because this one's practically new. I do have the perfume to this. I have, I brought it and put it over here. I've also been trying not to finish it because I only have this much left. And not that they don't have more in the store. I just, I would want to just keep it in my collection and I would have to rebuy it. But I think this is going to be in part of a project use it up as well. And so, yeah, that's the perfume to the Chirosa 62, which is, I believe, from Sol de Janeiro, the only perfume they have. Let me know if there's another one. I might have to get it if there is. So here we have the Real Radiance Cream that goes to this one right here. And again, I got this one in the summer. I didn't close that right, I think, from the last time I used it. This one, I, I'm going to have to use up this one. And it looks a little bit, maybe it's, let me know if it's all bad. I'm going to open it. This is the Bon Dia Bright Cream, which, let's see, goes with this one right here, the 40. So here, and honestly, I'm just matching the colors right now, guys. Barely has any. Why didn't I finish it? I don't know. Look at that. Is that bad? I'm going to just use, them on, use it on my feet. It should be fine. <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to use this one up tonight, put it next to the bed, and no reason to keep it. So here we have the Beja Floor Elastic Cream. Hopefully I'm saying that right. The number's right here on the side, 68, 68 right there. So yeah, this one I still have like half, maybe a little bit more than that. And this is my newest one. I've used it a couple of times. Um the 59 love this one this one is a thicker body butter body cream whatever than all of these like way thicker so yeah super moisturizing you do have to rub it in very well so there is that right there i think that is oh no one more right here and this one after hours this one is definitely like a deeper scent it is really good i heard someone comparing it i think it was casenia to into the night i'm not sure but yeah it's definitely in that family of like something deeper um yeah very beautiful scent though i really really like this one it has midnight jasmine and amber woods so yeah this is a good one and i haven't used it much at all because I was like, you know, maybe when I go out, I do need to bring it out. I We've gone on a couple of dates and I can definitely use that one up. I've obviously been using a lot more of my florals than this right here. So, which is a deep floral. So that is all that I have when it comes to my Sol de Janeiro collection. I hope that you guys enjoyed this little video and until the next one my friends i love you guys so so much please stay blessed bye guys